Hello, hi, this is Retroburn of the Imbacore YouTube channel and in this video we are going to compare the image quality of videos recorded with NVIDIA Shadowplay. Two sets have been recorded, one having videos recorded at 10 Mbps and another having 50 Mbps clips. Obviously, recording videos at 50 Mbps will produce videos of higher image quality. But does it necessarily translate to that when you upload the videos to YouTube? We shall see. So first off, why the need to record videos at 10 Mbps? The first reason for this is file size. File size. As you can see here, videos I've taken at 10 Mbps have an average size of 23.35% relative to the ones recorded at 50 Mbps. That's an average reduction of 76.65%. Less file size means shorter upload times which in turn means you can upload more in a given time span and less power consumption as you'll be using your PC for much shorter durations. Another thing I've noticed is that NVIDIA Shadowplay sometimes glitches up. Here is a sample where it crashed and burned. 4, 3, 2, 1. Ah. People are suggesting that some hard drives have deplorable read-write capabilities and so cause the glitch. While this is all conjecture, this is something that a lower bitrate can theoretically solve, so there is that. So on with the comparison. The following are clips showing me cruising through the northern wasteland in Rage. Resolution 1600 by 900, all settings maxed. Graphic options tweaked further via the NVIDIA control panel. For a tutorial on how to tweak via the NVIDIA control panel, see the link in the description box below. The second set has clips showing me prowling through the sewers in Rage. The same resolution, tweaks, and video settings were used. As you can see, the changes are minimal. And to set all doubts aside, just in case purists might say that the editing software I used have altered the videos, you can see the raw files on the NVIDIA Shadowplay bitrate comparison raw files playlist I created. Just search Imbacore NVIDIA Shadowplay bitrate comparison raw files on YouTube and the result page should show you the playlist. Alternatively, you can click on the link I put on the description box below. The playlist shows an altered and edited files I uploaded to YouTube. This has been Retroburn and you've just seen my NVIDIA Shadowplay bitrate comparison video. If you like this video guys, don't forget to like and or subscribe. Either one or both would be super. Stay cool, stay frosty.